Uh, yes, I had a cat that I was working on and doing a paw print for, and the cat just moving it, it had that last breath of air and it meowed. <laughs> oh, wow. What did you do? Uh, I checked to see if there was a pulse and if the cat happened to still be alive. It was not. Um, I do know how to tell if a cat or a pet has passed uh, just because of the training that I took back in high school, but it was not living. I think it was like a, a King Charles Spaniel, I'll never forget. And I think my mom went with me on a pickup. My mom doesn't like me to go alone to pickups late at night. So I showed up um, to someone's home and I always get out by myself and their pet was laying on the floor in their backyard and there was a couple family members that were around me and so you know we did the paperwork and payment and everything and then it was time for me to lift the pet and so um, it was you know kind of larger size uh, cavalier um, and so I placed one hand like in the neck to support the head and then one kind of like a the, like this behind kind of to lift them to lift him up and put him in the bed that we use or the carrier that we use and when I did lift, I felt it sounded like a bark when I lifted. And I put it down immediately and I looked up at the owners, like, did anyone hear that or was it was it just me? Because I swear I heard it bark. And I lifted it again and it barked again, or it sounded like a bark. And I looked up and I, you know, I looked like, is everything okay? I didn't say anything, I didn't ask, I was just kind of looking around for some kind of acknowledgement that I'm, I wasn't the only one who heard that. But no one reacted, no one said anything, and, and so the, dead, the dog had been dead for quite some time, so I took him into the car, and I drove off, and I told my mom what happened. And the whole ride home, um, I kept looking in the rearview mirror waiting for the dog to like wake up, but it wasn't, it really did have pass away. And I asked one of the vet, uh, one of our partner vets about it, and um, they did say that I might have just hit the throat and it was just a reflex of like air passing through or something so that's what it was. The coolest pet I ever got to work on um, was a, oh no what's it called with the spikes? Actually why don't we pause there, I'm going to just take a step forward okay. so it isn't the same static one shot I can A hedgehog, that's the word. Oh, the hedgehog.